Plants and animals have similar characteristics and differences between them. Today we're going to look at the differences and the similarities of both plants and animals. Similarities between plants and animals. We're looking at the first similarity between both plants and animals. Plants and animals, they grow and they grow in different sizes. Plants need both sunlight and they also need water. Why do they need both sunlight and water? It is important that they get sunlight and water because they need it so that they can grow and also to survive. Next we have reproduce. Now plants and animals they both reproduce but they reproduce differently. For plants they can reproduce both sexually and asexually while on the other hand for animals, animals reproduce sexually. Animals and plants not only grow and reproduce, but they also need air in order for breathing to take place. Now, when it comes down to the animals and the plants, they both breathe differently. For plants, plants respire, and animals, they breathe while respiring. We just looked at the similarities between plants and animals. Plants and animals also have differences, so now we're going to focus on the differences between both plants and animals. When it comes down to irritability, both plants and animals relate to their environment differently. Plants relate to stimuli slower than animals while animals relate to the stimuli faster than plants. Movement is another difference between plants and animals. While animals are always moving round about the environment continuously, plants remain in one place or area. Plants and animals feed differently. Plants make their own food by a process called photosynthesis. They are known to be autotrophic living things because they are able to make their own food. While for animals, animals get their food from other animals and plants. As we know that plants are the producers, and animals are the consumers. Animals, on the other hand, are known to be heterotrophs because they are not able to make their own food, therefore they have to look to other plants and animals in order to get food for survival. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Remember to tune in.